let's close my eyes and pick one. What's that? Hey guys, what's up? LD Shy Lady here. Today I'm doing a challenge that I have invented called the Blindfolded Creator Sim Challenge. Now, as you can probably guess, it involves creating a sim without the use of your eyes. Now, I would use a blindfold, but who actually has blindfolds lying around in their house? That's pretty weird. So I'm just gonna use my 100% natural blindfold, my eyelids. Very effective. <laughs> so I guess to start off with, we should give our sim a name and I'm gonna have to try and type this blindfolded. I would love to call her Alexandria. So let's see if we can manage that. Oh my gosh, this is so hard. What did I do? Oh my gosh, her name is now Akakustrua. Okay, I'm gonna give her the last name, Baguette, to match with my random genetics family. I can't remember how to spell it, but I don't think it matters anyway. We'll just try and get something, Baguette. Bavaget. <laughs> Close enough. All right then, Akakustrua Bavaget. Let's see what you are gonna look like, my love. So let's start off by randomly selecting a skin tone. I'm just gonna have to close my eyes and wiggle my finger around and then click. I clicked off it. I can see the flaw in this challenge now. Using your eyes is a big part of playing The Sims, but let's just try again. <gasps> oh no, we got a pink one. Okay, now we just have to randomly select a body type. I'm not really sure how I'm gonna do this, but let's just do it. We got one. So now we can move on to her face. Some new eyebrows, randomly choosing these ones. Okay, whoa. <laughs> Not bad. And now her eyes, we have to randomly choose a color. So I'm gonna choose this one. Ooh, nice. And then randomly choose a shape. So I'm gonna go with this one. Okay, she's looking very alien right now. Maybe the nose will change everything. So we just need to randomly select one. I'm gonna choose this one. Did, did I do anything? I can't even tell the difference. Okay, and now the lips. So I'm gonna choose this one. Okay. Let's not forget the ears. We need to randomly choose one. I'm gonna try. Oh, what did I do? Okay, this is a lot harder than I thought it would be. Let's randomly try and choose one. I want to try and go for the good one. Okay, phew, nice. Okay, and now we will pick a hair for her or rather many hairs, a full head of hairs for her. So I'm gonna pick a random style first. There are many good ones in there and many bad ones, so. Let's just randomly scroll and then click. Oh, very cute. And now I'm gonna pick a color. So hopefully I'm still hovering over the colors. Nope, I accidentally changed the hair. Well, let's pick a color for this. Okay, we got red, just like before. It's almost like it was fate. Let's move on to a hat. Scrolling randomly and then clicking. Oh no, what is that? Okay, you know what? There really weren't any good hats in there, maybe except for this one and this one, but of course we would end up with this hat of all the possibilities. <sighs> okay, now let's choose some accessories for her. So for accessories, I'm gonna randomize some earrings first of all. So let's close my eyes and pick one. What's that? Those are not earrings. Are you serious? What the heck? Why do I even have these? They come in all different colors too. What was I thinking? Well, I guess we better move on to glasses. So let's random lace alert these ones. Did I click something? Oh, uh, it was eyelashes. Okay, they can be a great asset. Finally for accessories, we'll move on to the necklaces. So I'm gonna close my eyes again and randomly pick one. Where, where is it? Did I miss click? Okay, let's try again. Click. Oh, that one's pretty cute. The rest of her accessories kind of let her down, but that one's not bad. Okay, now my worst enemy, makeup. This is kind of like the no mirror makeup challenge, except in The Sims. So let's start with the eyes. I'm gonna click on this one. Oh no! That is quite a look, Akakustrua. Very bold. I kind of like it though. So let's move on to eyeliner and we will select this one. Oh no! She looks ridiculous. Oh, okay, now it's time for the cheeks. Oh my gosh, there are so many awful choices we could hit. Let's try and go for a good one. Oh, that one's pretty cute. I like it. And now the lipstick. Once again, so many bad choices, but hopefully we can get a good one. Oh no, I'm not having that. No, it's freaking me out. I'm, I'm breaking my own rules and I'm not having that one. It's scary. Hopefully I can get something different. 
Okay, I think it was this one. That's pretty cute, actually. Not a look I would rock, but she's kind of working it. Now let's see if we can get some face paint that doesn't cover her entire face. Let's see. Oh, yes! Oh my gosh, I was hoping for that one. It's so pretty. Okay, but you know, kind of a lot going on there. So now we'll move on to her outfit. I'm gonna pick a top and a bottoms separately instead of a full body. So let's close my eyes and pray because we have a lot of crazy outfits in here. Let's go for this one. I clicked, I clicked off it, didn't I? Yes, I did. Let's try again. Boom. No, what is that? Why do I even have that in my collection? That is disgusting. Maybe we can redeem it with some nice pants. Okay, let's try this one. <gasps> oh, cute. And then we need some shoes to match, of course. Hopefully we don't get some ugly clown shoes or something. Let's pray this one. Okay, you know what? They're worse than ugly clown shoes. This is my worst nightmare. Well, I don't know if there's any point trying to do formal wear because nobody's gonna invite her to any formal parties. But let's see if we can pick randomly a nice dress. Oh my gosh, there's some crazy stuff in here. <laughs> it's gonna be a disaster if we get one of these. Oh my gosh, yeah. We had to be careful to avoid those, so let's do it. Okay, not bad, pretty bland. But with makeup like that, you don't need a flashy dress. So let's do her shoes now. Okay, they actually match. I don't know how I managed this, but I blindly matched her outfit. I am a genius. Whew. Okay, now athletic wear could be interesting. I mean, probably not more interesting than what she's currently wearing, but let's see. I will close my eyes and we will click. Okay, it was this one which is really cute actually. Not great for working out in, but super cute. And for the bottoms, we will give her these ones. Did I click anything? No, okay. We'll give her these ones. Oh, it was these. Some shorts, okay, unusual. Now the shoes, please give me some good workout shoes. Okay, what are those? I don't know, but I'm really digging those pink legs. And now, for the sleepwear, my favorite. Let's randomly select some shoes. I'm gonna try and aim for the kitty or the bunny slippers. And I missed everything. Okay, let's try again. <laughs> yes, I got the bunny slippers. Okay, now we can move on. I'm gonna do a full body suit for this one because we could get something interesting. Never mind. Never mind. What a disappointment. Right, so let's move on again to party wear. Oh, wow. Okay, I don't know where those glasses came from, but I dig it, love it. So should I pick a full body or a top and bottoms? I think we'll go for a full body because they're a little more interesting. So I'll close my eyes once more and click. Oh yeah, okay, of course. What else would I have found in this plethora of clothes but a black bunny suit? <sighs> well, let's hope we get some shoes to match. Okay, I'm gonna click this one. Oh no, they're hideous. Why are there so many hideous shoes in The Sims? <sighs> oh well, we will finally move on to swimwear and hopefully we get a pretty one. So let's go for full body, scroll blindly and click. Oh, are you serious? Of all the beautiful swimsuits that we could have, okay, that one's not so great. We could have been a mermaid, but no, we're a cyborg. I'm so unlucky. Well, that was quite a disaster.